Monster Links. This is the Ass Monster once again with The Evil Within 2. Uh, we briefed Kidman on what the hell's going on in here. So now we got. Apparently, the plan was Myra, Taurus, Kidman, and Theodore to get Lily out and then finally bring down the Mobius. Mobius. But unfortunately, Theodore went rogue and hired a serial killer by the name of Stefan. Stefan. Now, Theodore's now the one in control now, running running all over the place trying to find Lily. Myra's trying to keep Lily safe, but she's feeling the effects of the place, as we saw. So now, it's time to suit up, gear up, and get ready to go. Let me ask you a few more questions before I go. You said Myra was supposed to stay behind to take care of Mobius. How? By using STEM against them. Everyone in Mobius has a brain chip implanted in them that allows them to enter STEM without being affected by it. The chip allows them access and benefits that normal citizens don't have. And you let them put those things inside you? It's not like we were given much of a choice. Myra was supposed to send a signal back through STEM that would neutralize every member of Mobius via their brain chips. Basically like a mass remote control lobotomy. That's one way to solve the problem, I guess. If we don't do it, Mobius will just put Lily back in STEM and kill all of us for mutiny. It's the only way. I can't believe Kidman's behind all of this. She sent me into Beacon. She stood by while Lily was put into STEM. It doesn't seem like her to betray them. You're an outsider, Sebastian. You don't know what Kidman is really like. She had to keep her true self secret all this time so that she could get too, close enough to strike. But why now? Why not when they were building the new STEM? We need STEM to send the signal to take Mobius down. When Lily was chosen as the core, Myra and Kidman decided it was time to put everything into effect. The way things are going now, this could be our only chance to pull this off. So how did Theodore Wallace get mixed up in this? It was Theodore's idea of sending the signal through STEM. Now that I think about it, he probably just wanted to take over Mobius for himself. Damn it. I knew he wasn't trustworthy. That guy's slippery like a snake. But that's his game. He can convince people of anything. He convinced us that he was here to help us. Yeah. I've known people like that. They always seem like they're your best friend. Until they stab you in the back. One minute I was in a tidal wave of blood in Theodore's hellhole. The next thing I know, I'm in that house with you. I still don't understand how you found me. Me either. I was scouting the area around my safe house for supplies when I heard a girl's voice coming from that abandoned house. I went to investigate. No girl, but you were there. It's almost like I was led to you. A girl's voice? It had to be Lily. But how? There's no telling how or why things happen in here. Stem was already unpredictable before she escaped. But now? <sighs> I stopped trying to make sense of things a long time ago. Now I'm going to <laughs> I'm going to need some coffee first <laughs> because um, I've been going through a lot throughout this whole game. I need my coffee. I need my cup of joe. Just like I take my drugs, I got to have my cup of joe. <sighs> oh yeah. That was actually tar, but you know. Yeah, we're suiting up. About to go back out into the hole. Oh. Written in neat feminine hand, the most recent entry phone. Oh, it's Doris. Not sure how long I've been waiting for Myra and Theodore to return. Time a sketchy concept incites them, even more so since Lily escaped. All I know is that they should have returned by now. If I die here, I just want whoever finds this diary to know that I went in willingly. I did something a long time ago. Something a long time ago. Something that I regret, and that's why I'm here now, waiting to take Lily out of here. This is my last chance of redemption. Maybe a shot at starting my life over. Either way, I'm committed to this plan. I see it through to the end, no matter what. But it's obvious something went wrong. If that's the case, I should keep an eye out for help, like Kidman told me to. But this place is falling apart around me. I hope I can find him if he gets inside. Yep, and here I am. Yeah. I'm going to save because the premiere was a long time ago. I mean, look at that. Chapter 8 to chapter 11. Hey, is there a mirror here? Uh, which way is which? Ah, right. Yeah, because I think we got enough, we could start leveling up some more. Let's go. 
first, weapons. Can't have enough weapons. You gotta always have some weapons. Yeah, I think I only have two of these, so. Dang, that's 800? And that's 360. That was probably the stupidest thing I ever did then. What's kind of annoying is that... Oh, wait. Yeah, I do. I actually do have one of those. My bad. Let's see. Increases by distance. Yeah. It's a good thing that opens all barriers for that. I forgot about the chain thing. Never mind, never mind. Regret we regret it now, but we can't hold up on it. Alright, back in the chair. We've got to stop meeting like this, detective. Yes, I know. You're back. Me. New knowledge requires new ability. If you knew something I didn't, you could have just told me and saved me the headache. If only I could. But this is a journey you must... But I'm not alone. I found others to help me. Taurus, Hoffman, O'Neill. They are there to accompany you. But the discovery is yours alone to make. Discovery. And self-discovery. That's what makes STEM so... intriguing. That's true. Wait a minute, did I find a key? Yeah, yeah, I did. I found a key, I just haven't used it. Oh wait, I can get more health. Hey, what's that? If an, if an attack would have just barely done enough to kill you, just grit your teeth and bear it to remain alive with a small amount of health. It's actually really good. Total health recovered when regenerating from your stuff is increased. Huh. What do you think? Yeah, I think it would be more beneficial if I do that. Because doing this is good and all, but I've been kind of good not taking it. Now we got a key, so let's... Yeah, I'll take the last of that ammo. And we'll open another one. That'll come in any later. Now let's get a move on. I do gotta say, who knew Theodore was another nut job? Well, we we immediately knew him right away. I'm backtracking. I didn't mean to go that way. I meant to go this way. This will take me to exit 72. All right. Let's hope the marrow is still there. If it's not there, we are screwed. Anyway, we need to go to a new one. Get some help. The good thing is we got a guy working on back door so he can help us out. Plus he might help us out if we tell him that there's a way to knock out the chip once we're out. Who knows, everybody's got an agenda. Mobius, the troops, us. So good. Fallen Mobius operative. What is there not a Fallen Mobius operative? Hey, what's that? Condenser. This portable condenser unit is used in laboratories to cool gases and condense them into liquids. This component can be used to craft useful items. Huh. So we got a new. So we got a new component. <laughs> I 
gotta say, going back to people now is not really an option in this game anymore. <laughs> and we're back to linear, people. We're back to linear. Alright, here we go again. That's two. That's that. That's one. Oh, just flip them all. That was the easiest one. And then something tries to murder me. Never mind, but we do got candles. Looks like Theodore's been here. Maybe that's why I couldn't contact O'Neill. Most likely. The safe house is nearby. I should check up on her. Yeah. Let's hope she hasn't been brutally murdered. Trail of blood straight to the safe house. Hoffman, you here? Another well, one of these. What happened here? Well, let's figure out what happened. But I think Hoffman might be dead. Leo? Is that you? Leo? Is that you? How is my communicator getting your signal? Never mind. It doesn't matter. Where are you? That's on the other side of the laboratory. It's a restricted area. We were told never to go there. We don't have clearance. How did you... Okay, I understand. Yes, I'll meet you there. Just be careful. She was being lured. O'Neill left his safe house to go to a restricted area of the Marrow? That doesn't sound like him. Yeah, I know. It's like the, the guy we know is very timid. He doesn't want to risk his own life. Time is a concept in size stem always being tricky, but the disappearance of the core collapsing eating has amplified its tenfold. Change has become even more pronounced since Sebastian left to confront Stefano. I'm afraid that he must have failed. I've been keeping a close eye on things via the security cameras. Not only is Union changing, but the corruption has spread to the marrow itself. It's changing, shifting, items appearing seemingly from nowhere. Creatures that defy imagination imagination wandering the halls. I'm not leaving the safe house until I have a damn good reason to to do it. But who knows? How long a safe house can remain safe this year? Well, unfortunately, well, it's kind of a good thing she left, but at the same time, it's not a good idea that she left. Let's get going. So she, so she went to go to O'Neill after picking up a signal. I kind of feel like that's a trap. Oh, we got... Wow, this is like a gimme pouch. Because they put it directly in your way, so you automatically have this. Where am I keeping these pouches, by the way? I'm just getting more and more pouches. Hey. Shit. Thing, the power of my gun is almost maxed out, and the critical damage is great as well. Unfortunately, I, this is not a crate I can open. Alright, let's continue. Make a move to the elevator. Oh, better be ready. The other door opens. Looks like they had extra security for this place. Yeah, but they all got slaughtered, obviously. 
you know, that's impossible to read that, but I'll take it. Due to the sensitive nature of experiments being conducted, the lab laboratory is only accessible to, to Mobius operatives with the proper Unity Cerebral chip designation. Please observe all security protocols when entering the, lo the laboratory and be aware your clearance level also binds you to top secret non disclosure tenants, as outlined in your enlistment contract. Any operative attempting to access the laboratory without proper clearance will be subjected to corporal punishment, as outlined in Mobius security bylaws. <laughs> Oh, that actually did not feel good. I know I'm burping, but oh, that that did not feel good. Don't you? Okay. Whoa, this is too much like Resident Evil now. This hallway. What's next? Lasers. By the way, I didn't like the last Resident Evil movie. That sucked. All tanks. What's this about? It's like they're experimenting on all the creatures. I didn't like the last Resident Evil movie. They just threw stuff together in order to get an ending. But it sucked. It made... It's like they were trying so hard to make it something that totally defied everything they made from it. The story, the plot. Just went out the window. And I mean the original story, not the BS story that they made. <laughs> In the world of video games, welcome to the event. Welcome to the invention of the super rock hard drapes. You will never be able to push these. They are super rock hard. Can't pass through without one of those chips. Gotta be one around here somewhere. Probably. Oh, there's probably one. And then the witch will appear and try to murder my face. I don't know what the witch is trying to tell me, but she's pissing me off, though. So. Oh my god, why does the phone keep going off? I keep getting, like, calls from all kinds of random people. And not people that... I know. I got two signals. Alright, let's shack it open. Oh crap. Oh, I already got the thing equipped. Let's go. No, I didn't get the thing equipped. Okay. Do that just yet. <laughs> Jeez, what's with all these? Oh, it's a resonance point. Populous has succumbed already. Our efforts have been in vain. The core escaped less than a day ago. Within hours, we began to receive reports of loss emerging in staggering numbers. They're everywhere now. 20% of Union's populace has succumbed already, and they're actively hunting down and killing whoever is left. It's a nightmare. At this rate, there will be no one left in two weeks. We've lost contact with Mobius. We're trapped in here. With the lost. It's too late to stop now. The entire Union experiment is doomed. We're all doomed. I'm sorry. Well... Hey, wait a minute, what's that? Another pouch? Yeah, it's a stem pouch. Finally be- I'm finally able to actually hold on to more of my freaking drugs. Well, that's a miracle right there, I can tell you that. It's another resonance point, something about I've seen something. the monsters man yeah it looks like this just circles around so I should make my way back down well, more handgun ammo 
Yeah, this is too... This is placed too well. What do we have here? You know what? Yeah. Um, yeah, no. No, not, no. Actually, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, I don't have a code. I don't even have a code, so I can't even do whatever this is. Oh, wait. Our worst fears have been realized. The lost phenomena has spread the Mobius operatives. We had theorized the transformations were a result of memory overwrite, but no operatives have been overridden. Oh, but no. We were able to quarantine and terminate and affect the Mobius operative before he could transform. Perhaps his exposure is new. <coughs> Coincidence, we're harvesting his Unity Cerebral Trip. We'll provide new data, remove of the text Cerebral Trips as possible with the extraction device. Place the subject, 012. If they haven't removed this guy's chip yet, I can use it to get through that door and find Hoffman. Zero, one, two, eight. Okay, let's see what happens. He's got like spring alive, ain't he? Warning! This is a disclaimer. This is too weird. Oh, there's the oh, Thank God he's already dead. I gotta get out of this lab. Knew it. Go this way for a second. This is too creepy. You know, I think I'm gonna get murdered by the witch if I do this. It's lonely here and creepy dumping these bodies, these things into this pit and they just keep coming. How did I end up with this detail? Been hearing things, voices coming from the pit, but that can't be. But if they aren't coming from the pit, then they're in my head and that's even worse. Oral hallucination is one of the symptoms. But I can't be infected, it's not a virus or bacteria, it's a mental thing. That only affects citizens whose memories have been rewritten. At least that's what they told me. Shit, I gotta keep it together. It's just loneliness that makes me think this like this. Loneliness and being around these freaky corpses. It's a tough phenomenon. Well, unfortunately. Oh, no. He's Shh. coming. I gotta get out of here. Yeah, but the door's shut. Don't do this to me. I knew it. No. Oh. And there's nobody out. <laughs> Why do you keep doing this to me? That thing again. I... Well, actually, this is very interesting, to tell you the truth. I'm not really freaked out, but I am very, very interested. Crap. Can 
I go this way? No, I can't. But I didn't really have an option. So now she's hovering in the air. This is like the white blob guy. It's a good thing that I'm able to move more. You are just becoming a dick. I was just over that way. It's just so much of a dick move, man. That was... I gotta say, you're a dick! I was just over there. Hey. Who is she a part of, anyway? She's like part of me, or part, part of Theodore. Can't be part of Stefano. Stefano's dead. It should be, um... Yeah, yeah, yeah that'll work. She's just gotta go that way. The good thing is she can only see me, not hear me. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. You know what? This is kind of interesting, though. Why is she floating? I mean, she's been known to glide through walls, but this is just... I don't know. It's just different. It's different from the usual. <laughs> oh, great. Now she's down here. I say, who's she a part of? Me? Wow, that's actually cool. Creepy, but cool. Can I say it's a good thing my crouch is so much faster. Nope. Oh, there she is. I can see her through the thing. Crap. You know, trying to circle around here is getting very difficult. That's what she does. She like sucks out my soul. Huh. Well. Wait a minute. How far do I go back? Do I go back to upstairs or do I start downstairs? But how did she see me? She was facing that way. The opposite direction. Loading is annoying. Okay, yeah, but I'm reaching the 30-minute mark, so I'm going to the end of the video. So anyway, the Oz Monster signing off to the next video. See ya.